Now we're going to go over the duck on the, from the turtle position. Now, I'm in that crawl space underneath him. I make sure, before I escape here, what I want to do is, I'm going to bring my head out to one side, the same side I bring my head out. That leg comes up, come over, grab the wrist. Now, I bring my knee that's on the floor. I shoot it through my armpit. When I do that, I bring my head and neck up on his back. So, I slice it through. My head and neck on his back. My leg right next to his leg. Now I'm just going to loop this leg over. When I loop this leg over, I'm going to bring my chest up on his back. So I loop, move up on his back. Look the way I point my toes in, above his knees. Not on top, just above. Now when Nikki goes to get up, I get my hooks in first. Before, guys, sometimes when I'm here and I want to try to break him down, he's got his elbows underneath him tight. So I just come underneath, grab his wrist, fold it in, pelvis forward, flatten him out. Now, we take that choke. I'm in that crawl space, everything out to one side. So, head out to one side, that leg is up, I come over, grab his wrist. I shoot my knee through my armpit, right next to his leg. I keep my head and my neck on my opponent's body. Now, it's very important. When I loop this leg over, I have to make sure that my leg is right next to his leg. That way when I loop this over, I'm right up on the back where I want to be. If I sit through and my leg is off, okay, it's not right next to my opponent's leg, I'm only going to be hooking onto one leg. I'm not going to get that back the way I want it. So I make sure my leg's right next to his when I sit through. Now I loop this over, I'm right up where I want to be. Point my toes in, that way when he gets up, hooks fall right inside. Destroy his base by pulling his hand towards my knee, pelvis forward, slip that hand right underneath, take the rear naked choke.